What's going on guys, it's your boy Jeff, and here with another video. As you can see, it's that time of the year, I'm going to do my NBA playoff prediction. You know, I know I didn't do one last season, but I did a NBA final prediction. But for now on, I'm going to do a first round prediction for each one. I'm going to do a second round pick, and then I'm going to do last one, and then I'm going to do the finals. So, you know, I haven't been paying attention about NBA, but, you know, since it's, like, sports-wise and people are interested, you know, why not do this video? So, if you haven't seen my NHL prediction video, um, I did a Western and Eastern, make sure you check that out. So, we're going to start, um, since my last video was in the West, we're going to start in the East again. My last video for NHL started in the Western Conference. I'm going to start in the East. So, in the 1 versus 8 matchup, we got the Atlanta Hawks versus Brooklyn. You know, what I heard, the Hawks been pretty, pretty good. You know, the Nets are decent, but not enough. The Hawks are just, I think, have the best record in the league right now. I'm not sure if it's them or Golden State, but... You know, I like the Hawks here. I think the Hawks can pull it out. I think they're going to win in five games. So I got the Hawks winning to the next round. The four versus five matchup is the Toronto Raptors and the Washington Wizards. Now, like I said, I'm not really good with teams and their players. I haven't seen any team play both of these. But this is going to be really close. I think. The Wizards are pretty good, I think, this year. The Raptors. So, I actually think the 5 seed will get the win. So, I think the Wizards will get beat the Raptors in 6 games. So, right here, we got the Hawks and the Wizards. That's going to be a hell of a match over there. Now, this is going to be a hell of a series. The 2 versus 7 involving the Cleveland Cavaliers versus the Boston Celtics. I used to be a Boston Celtics, and I'm just kind of shocked that they made the playoffs. You know, I was I, I watched Ray John Rondo get traded to Dallas Mavericks. You know all that, but the Celtics they're 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 decent this year. But you know they have like experienced players on their team, and you know there's one player I heard that's pretty good on the Celtics, and I haven't been updating on them, but. Um, they can, you know, the offense on the ball is good, you know, defense on the ball is good. But if you look at Cleveland, they got LeBron James, you know, got some good players on there. It's going to be a hell of a series. I really don't think it's going to go a long series. I think the Cleveland Cavaliers are going to dominate the Boston Celtics. So that's where I'm going. I think the Cleveland Cavaliers are going to beat the Celtics in six games. So the Cleveland Cavaliers move on to the second round. The three versus six involves the Chicago Bulls hosting to the Milwaukee Bucks. The three versus six. Chicago Bulls, luckily, I, I think Derrick Rhodes. I'm pretty sure Derrick Rhodes is back. I'm not sure. Chicago Bulls definitely playing well. Milwaukee, eh, not so well, you know. Quite obviously, see who I'm going for here. I think the Bulls will take this. I think the Bulls will beat the Bucks in at least six or five. I can't remember what I put in my paper, but I think the Bulls will win six games. So that's it for the video. I'm going to do the Western later. So that's what I have for my Eastern prediction. I got the Hawks to beat the Brooklyn Nets in five games. I got the Wizards beating the Raptors in six. Cleveland Cavaliers beating the Boston Celtics in six, and Chicago beating the Bucks in six. So that's my prediction, prediction guys. So I'll be back for the West.